Hello guys, today I will show you how to make a cool preloader pre animation which will look like this after the coding of HTML and CSS files. We are not going to use any kind of JavaScript code for it. It uh, looks like a, mm, it is fading after some time. You can see in the screen. Okay, now let's see how to make this. Here I have the basic HTML skeleton which I got from the sublime text editor you can use any kind of text editor such as notpad plus plus or brackets or any whatever you like okay now in the body tag I would like to write a div tag with ID of say preloader I am opening and closing this div tag okay okay now inside the div tag I am opening one more div tag and uh, give it a name of ID equal to can give it square ID and open it and close it okay now in this animation you can see there are almost eight eight squares eight, eight squares are there so we will use 8 div div text for it so i am copying it 8 more times okay 1 mm, 2 what is going on 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 okay I am giving them same ID of the square okay I will separate them by using the and style property in the CSS file if you have not watched my previous video I suggest you to watch my previous videos for under better understanding it okay now I'm saving it and uh, I am opening the CSS file and in the ID called preloader I'm writing this I am giving the width of uh, 300 pixels and uh, height of 50 pixels and the margin top of 300 pixels and margin left of 600 pixels this will show our animation in the center of the screen ok now for the id square I am writing this I want to display them in a line so I will write display in line block and uh, the background color I want black color so I would like to write FFF which is the code for black color and I want to give the width of uh, 30 pixels and height of 30 pixels for the square so it will create a square of 30 pixels of the color black I am applying the animation here the name of the animation is load it will last for 2 seconds the animation timing function is the is and it is for infinite time ok now for the square I am using the ant child property now it will affect only the first child of the now it will affect only this this div tag okay because I have written one here so I want this to left 0 pixels and I want animation delay to 0 seconds for it because the first child will not have any kind of animation delay now I'm copying and paste it seven more times because we have seven more squares okay now for the second child I am writing left is 30 pixels and animation delay is you can say 1 point point 10 seconds I am writing I am writing this left 30 pixels because I want the second square which is this the second square is 30 pixels away from this starting from the origin okay 
so i'm writing 30 30 pixels uh oh so i'm writing here left 30 pixels okay and animation delay is 10 seconds so sorry 0.10 seconds for this second child there will also a margin of 30 pixels I, it is 60 and 0.12 20 for this 0 0.90 0 0.30 now for fourth child uh oh it is fifth child oh, it is the fourth child for this it is 120 and it is 0.40 now for sixth child it is 150 and 0.50 now for seventh child it is at 30 more pixels and the animation delay is you can say 0.60 seconds and for it it is 210 pixels and animation delay is 0.70 seconds okay now for the keyframes or for the animation coding i am writing the name of the animation that is load and i want animation at zero percent you can say oh at zero percent i want the background color color to be white and at hundred percent i want the background color to be black and i also want to, to scale so i will use transform property and the scale i will reduce it to 0.2 okay it will be at 100 percent because you can see that oh, oh. because you can see I'm sorry because here you can see that the, at the end the background color is white you can see here first of all the background color is black no first there is a white color and then it comes black and at the end of the animation it comes to white white color okay so I have used that and now that's cool and I also want the background color of the body to I can say I'm giving it a light blue color okay I'm saving it and I'm reopening this in the browser then you can see that uh oh mm, there's a problem okay mm, I should apply animation delay 20 second I'm increasing all the animation delay 40 50 it is 60 it is 70 and this is 8 child and 80 second okay now it's cool I'm reopening in this in browser and now you can see this <clears throat> it is a nice animation effect that we have created using HTML and CSS only okay so that's it for this video if you guys like this video please subscribe to this channel and please like my video if you have any doubts about this video or any previous video you can comment down below okay thank you guys for watching this video I will see you in the next video.